All right, I finally got my mic fixed. Sorry about that, folks. Anyway, now it is going to be Saji Gunpow taking on Doctor Kugawa. <laughs> あなたたちのような殺しも分かるはずない。自分の強さを誇りたいだけのために戦い合ってる。たったら最後の一人になるまで潰し合うように私が手伝ってあげる。そう。それこそ私に与えられた宿命だっていう力を持った私。本当のサ
What the hell is she talking about? What the hell? Everything's all black and gray and weird. And there's a cell over the ring. Amazing. Well, this is the dream world. Uh, oh, sorry, not the dream world. This is the darkness world. Sorry, wrong world. Anyway, here we go. Both women are going back and forth. Well, not back and forth. Saji, oh, now Saji. Some shots there to... No, just throws her up and over the steel steps. I just got all of them steel steps, and this is this is definitely personal. I mean, when you steal someone's soul, that is personal as hell. Somebody stole my soul once, and I just I was so pissed off, I was ready to kill him. And then I did, but killing is wrong. <laughs> anyway, now yeah, that was a back rake, and another one just raking the back of Doc Sakura. Sakura now from behind. It. Saji Gunpow. Man, I have not seen a match with two women in one cage since... Well, since Cinemax last night. But anyway, oh! Suplexes are right into that steel cage. And it wasn't really a match, it was more or less Cinemax. So, yeah. Anyway, now, just raking the back. Over and over again, making her feel the pain. And there's a clothesline to the back of the head. Now lifts her up. And throws her into those steel steps. And that chanting is a little annoying. But either way, it's the dark world. It's death and reincarnation and stuff. Oh, oh man, what a suplex there under, the, under that steel wall. It's so weird, this whole area. It's even weirder knowing that... I don't know. I kind of like this. It's very soothing to hear just... Oh. Anyway, it's just wailing away on her with a steel chair. Now what's she doing here? Oh, she's just going on the assault. Is Doc Sakura. Sakura now whipping Saji into the ring. Got a hold of the chair Saji was using. Uh-oh, we've seen this one already. She's got the ankle set up in that chair and... Oh, just stomps on the ankle. Stomps on the chair and closes it up on the ankle. And now, oh, there's a knee to the base, I think. And everything's getting all... This is definitely the dark world. I mean, look at this. Everything is just getting so foggy and messy and crazy. And everything's slowing down to where you can barely move and see anything. And now, you know, whips her into that buckle. Into the ring post, I mean. Whips her up and over. Uh-oh, what's Doc Sakura doing up on top? And there's a double axe handle, but Saji used her magical powers to avoid it. And she just rams her shoulder into the into that midsection, and she hits the cage. And there's a baseball slide, but didn't hit, because Saji Genpao was magical. Now Gunpow from behind. Uh-oh, she's got double leg. Oh, drops her face into the mat, into the cage. Now what's she doing? Throws her into the cage with authority. Ah, she's just holding on and now like, there's a few strikes there by Doc Sakura. Doc Sakura! Oh, tripped over the ring steps. And now wait, uh-oh, she's going for something here. She's got her set up and power bomb right through that steel wall, that steel cage cell dealy deal. Anyway now, what's she gonna what's Doc Sakura planning on doing here? Uh-oh, Doc Sakura climbing up the cage. I'm wondering, how the hell are they having a match in the Dark World if the referee's here? I mean, wouldn't it be like... And how the hell am I here? I mean, wouldn't it be like some really special place where you can... Where, it, like, only two people could go and they're like... Because they're magical? That means... I'm magical too. Awesome! Joel Knight is now magical! And there's a punch to the head. Excuse me a minute, I'm going to wish myself up a pizza. Yes! Pepperoni! Okay. Anyway, there was a backbreaker. Mm. Damn. Dark Side Pizza rocks. Anyway, now, the backbreaker, and she's taunting her, and... Elbow to the head. Mm. Damn. Dark Side Pizza really does rock, though. Anyway, now, arm ringer. Now, wait a minute, there's a reversal into a front face lock. Uh-oh, she's got a hold of the leg, and now... Ah, oh, knee breaker there on Dark Sakura. Falls it up with an elbow to the head. 
Now what's she gonna do here? Saji throws her. Oh, she tried to throw her off, but she missed. Or didn't miss, but she held her balance. Both women going back and forth. Both women are hurting here. And there's a hard right hand. Anyway, what's gonna happen here? She's got a hold. She's got her up, and she's just staggered, dizzied, if you will. Now what's she? Uh oh, she's setting her up. Here comes it. Oh, it's choke slam. Hits her head, back of the head on that steel, and that's unforgiving steel, folks. It doesn't send you any apologies or sympathy cards or any of that crap. It hates you. Anyway, now. Saji Gunpow, what's she doing? Uh oh, Saji's setting her up. She's got her up. Uh oh, Saji. She's going for a tombstone power driver. Right on top of the steel cage. Vicious move there by Saji. Now Saji gonna go throw Zox. Wait a minute. Uh oh. Uh oh. She's setting her up. Here it comes. It, this could be. It's uh, gonna be a. Uh, it's a. Uh, oh my god! Wow, what the hell happened? Wait a minute, she just turned the tables on Saji. What the hell? She just reversed it on Saji. And Saji got power bombed off the steel cage. Doc Sakura said it was her world, so I don't know what Saji Gunpow is going to plan on doing now. With that knowledge in her head. There's a shot to the back. A kick in the back. Sends her flying up against that cage, and again. Now what's she doing here? She's setting her up, and there's a neck breaker under the knee. This music is just so eerily cool. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Joel the Dark Side Knight. But anyway, <laughs> I'm the Dark Knight now. That's awesome. But anyway, Saji Gunpow was... Well, now she's getting up. Saji Gunpow. Well, she's trying to climb up the cage. She's she's done it. Saji Gunpow now. What's she gonna do here? Oh, let's go dive at the legs. But Sakura moved out of the way. And Sakura with a chop block to the left knee. Now what's Sakura gonna do here? Sakura got her up and backbreaker on Saji. Now Saji is oh, there's a face buster. Oh, guillotine leg drop face buster in. Doc Sakura back in the ring and this this has gotta be it already. Saji Gunpow's been taken to hell. Now what's she doing? She's going underneath the ring for something. She can't find anything. You'd think you'd be able to find something under the ring. I mean there's like thousands of weapons. Hell, they even put stuff that doesn't even belong under the ring, like, you know, like uh sledgehammers. It's like who the hell needs a sledgehammer to fix a ring? But anyway, here we go. Uh oh, this is not gonna be good for Saji. And Oh, does the knee to the... Oh, sorry. Just jumps her head first across the steel. Now what's she doing here? Doc Sakura going underneath the ring and... Oh, she's got a hold of a sledgehammer. See, I told you. Really, who the hell needs a sledgehammer to fix a ring? Who the hell needs a sledgehammer to build a ring? Now what's she doing here? Doc Sakura's got a hold of those steel steps. Maybe she changed her mind. Uh-oh, she's got a hold of that steel tear. Now wait a minute. Oh man, that's concussion on delivery. Now what's gonna happen here? To that move. This could very well be it. I mean, really, this is just this has gotta be it. Saji Gunpowder has been taking pillar to post here. That's gotta be it. One, two, it's over. Doc Sakura is your winner. She is still the SEA rule.
Bizi.